it's not just a tool, it's a whole end-to-end -end methodology on how to engage and approach executives, how to do discovery, how to calculate the ROI, and how to present the ROI back in the exact terms and process that an executive needs to see. And everything about it has been built in and customized around the Cisco resellers selling environment. Certainly the value of ERS is, is one, is usability. So it's, a, it's very well laid out, it's very easy to use, and uh, it's Excel based at its core, but it's, it's framed and packaged very well. So if I can go find the data, I can plug it in, and, and then it leads to its back end value, which is the reporting. And the reporting is uh, it's graphical, it, it, it's, uh, it's relevant, and it's put in uh, a framework that a financial executive, frankly, expects and wants to see. ERS is definitely a differentiator for INX. While a lot of our competitors are still selling at the speeds and feeds level, or maybe some of the more enlightened ones are selling at the solution sales level, you know, we're going in and talking the business value story using ERS. The training, number one, was great, um, pulling together sales and pre-sales and having them think about, again, the positioning to an executive level conversation as well as how to talk to them about how it's going to affect their bottom line within the business, um, I think has been very important. But the successes that we've already seen, it's opened some doors in some big accounts. It's helped us broaden our perspective on everything that we do, not just, the, not just UCS and really not just data center. I mean, it's gotten, it's gotten the sales reps thinking about, in executive terms, how do the things that we do on a daily basis for our clients, how does it affect, the, how does it affect their bottom line? The favorite part about the ERS training was the buy-in that I saw from the pre-sales engineers. That really impressed me because as a sales guy, I, I get it and I understand why we want to have these financial conversations and why we always talk about and try to you know, enter at the CXO level. Um, what I thought was really interesting was how the pre-sales engineers really bought into and understood how that messaging and talking about cash flows and you know, EBITDA and, then, and all the things that I didn't really think that would interest them, those are the things that they really caught on to. I think the ERS training uh, was delivered in a very positive, but also a very easy to comprehend way, which is uh, very important uh, when you're dealing with so many complex technologies. Uh, and so for us, it was a great fit because our sales staff and our uh, solution architects and practice managers really were able to engage with David, but also uh, they felt like they really understood. They walked out of there thinking very, feeling very confident uh, about what they had just learned, and that's important. When we did the ERS training, I really wasn't sure what it was going to be going into it. And as we started the training, I realized that nothing really had to do with IT through this training process. And so it started getting me into a different, I guess, style of thinking and how I would present this to people who I usually talk with and present to, but in a completely different method. Um, and then through the training, I also just learned how to basically sell to a customer without talking about a specific project or um, a specific widget. The training for me, I think the biggest impact to me as a salesperson is that I'm always thinking about what, how does this financially impact their business. It takes me as a salesperson out of the technology and really wanting to further understand how does this financially impact them? Does it in improve their efficiency? Does it improve their productivity? How much are they spending today? What's their cost of money on their dollar? How do they make their dollars today? And I think if I have an understanding of that, then I really create a value into the customer's business. I've got the rest of the sales organization at Nexus clamoring to me about, we need to have this approach. I want to know how those guys are opening doors in these large enterprise accounts and having this type of conversation at this level about these types of products within that entire continuum. That's, that's going to change the way we do business. I would highly recommend uh, for organizations to engage in the ERS program. I think it's a, it's a worthwhile investment. I think it's, it, for us, you know, we were able to see some fairly quick return. Uh, and not only that, it, it allowed us to get much deeper in our custom organizations, but also at a much higher level, uh, which is where you want to be.